The internet erupted with excitement when a post listing confirmed celebrities for the Met Gala 2024 surfaced, prominently featuring Lisa, the beloved member of Blackpink. Fans of Lisa were abuzz with anticipation at the prospect of seeing Lisa grace the prestigious event's red carpet. However, their hopes were soon dashed when it was revealed that the post originated from a high-fashion Instagram account known for sharing unverified news. Disappointment swept through the fandom, yet fans held on to the glimmer of hope that Lisa might still attend the Met Gala. The speculation surrounding Jisoo, Blackpink's eldest member, who had never before attended the Met Gala. Fans eagerly anticipated the possibility of seeing both Lisa and Jisoo make their debut appearances at the renowned event. With Rose and Jenny having previously graced the Met Gala red carpet, fans now yearned for the complete Blackpink experience at the 2024 event. Despite the initial letdown caused by the false information, rumors continued to swirl regarding Lisa's potential attendance at the Met Gala. As the event date drew nearer, whispers of Lisa's presence only intensified, fueling the excitement within the fandom. What are your thoughts? Meanwhile, Baby Monster performance on Inkageo is being praised for turning a music show into a festival. Since they released Ashish, the members have gained attention for their live performances. On April 28, Baby Monster performed on Inkageo and once again stole the hearts of fans with their band version. In particular, Ahayan gained attention when she shouted, Inkageo, are you ready, before the members went into the chanting section of the song. Both times, they impressed viewers with their obviously live vocals. They especially loved Ahayan's extra ad-lib when she hyped up the crowd with, M Countdown, Are You Ready, and Inkageo, Are You Ready, which further showed that their use of backtrack was minimal. When the performance was released, it became a hot topic over the days that followed. Although it was just a music show performance, netizens loved how passionate the Baby Monster members were and how they treated it like a full-blown festival in front of thousands of fans. Though most viewers seemed to enjoy their performances, others commented that it was too much for just a music show, with one even asking why they are doing all of this, just for Inkageo. Fans immediately came to their defense. They disliked how the girls were receiving criticism for overperforming, when doing the opposite would have been worse. They noted it was a strange situation for the members to be disliked for being good at their jobs. Singing live, after all, should be the ideal in their eyes. Rather than thinking it was cringeworthy to see a group make the most of a small stage, they were proud of them for putting so much effort into giving the best kind of experience to all audience members. At the end of the day, they wanted the girls to know that they were supporting them at all times.